In 2005, Gopal started his own business. In two years time, he was extremely successful. That was because Gopal was hardworking, driven and very ambitious. Not just that, Gopal was a big gadget freak. He loved to you know, upgrade himself with all the latest gadgets and the latest versions as well. Gopal also believed in having a life that was very grand. So he had a plush office, he had a lot of luxury goods and the like. In 2008, his business was hit by the recession and in order to maintain his current lifestyle, Gopal went ahead and got extra loans. Today, in hindsight, he feels this was a big mistake that he had done. Instead of curbing his money outflow, Gopal had actually gone in for more loans, which he thinks was not the best thing to do. While loans can be helpful, definitely, in many ways, but how do you differentiate between a good loan and a bad loan? So let me give you some pointers here, and you could use this for loans, either for your personal life or for your business life as well. The first thing, what is the purpose of the loan? Why do you want this loan? How are you going to use it? Is it to procure an asset or is it for your expenses? If it is for an asset, is it for an appreciating asset or a depreciating assets? Ask yourself these kind of questions. Second, by taking the loan, how is it going to improve the financial situation? You know, your individual financial situation or the financial situation of your business. How exactly it's going to help you? What is the benefit? Are you just looking at benefits for a short term or do you have a long term vision as well? Think through that. Third, what is the cost of the loan? Can you afford it? Let me also tell you now in the current situation, the RBI Reserve Bank of India is giving moratorium and remember it comes with a cost, right? The fourth, how is it going to contribute to the growth, be it your business growth or your financial, uh, your personal growth, how is the loan going to help you? The last one, what would be the consequences? Supposing you're not in a position to pay this loan, what would be the consequences? How would you feel at that time? How do you think you can manage it? Think about it and reflect to your own self. So ask yourself a lot of you know, questions regarding to the loan, the loan that you want to take. And can you even do away without a loan? Ask yourself that as well. So whilst you think and reflect on these lines, you would be able to get a clearer picture and you yourself will be in a position to know which is a good loan and which is not such a good loan for you, right? So think through, remember that you don't need to bite off more than you can chew, yeah? And uh, if you found this useful, do share it with your friends so that they can also benefit out of it. And um, yeah, wishing you the very best and do subscribe to Sang Shasum and the bell icon as well. And signing off here is your high performance business coach, Sangeeta Shankar Sumesh. Until the next time, see you. Bye from me, Sangeeta.